Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of House of Bugs. Today I'll be transforming into Weird Girl from Tim Burton's Frankenweenie. I filmed this back in July or August as you can probably tell by my peach hair. So it's kind of a mess, but if you are interested in seeing how to spook fight into Weird Girl then just keep on watching. First up, I'm going to be applying some normal foundation. I need a shade or two lighter than my skin because Weird Girl is very porcelain if you see her in the non-black and white photos. To highlight, I'm going to be using Kat Von D Beauty's Locket Concealer and just blending it in with a beauty blender. So I'm going to be creating her giant eyes out of my entire eyelid. I'll be creating a half moon shape on my lower lash line and then completely cover up my upper lid with the Magic Cake Aqua Paint. My eyes are super deep set, so I kind of have to make up the shape of my eyelid to be a perfect circle. So do what you gotta do depending on your eye shape. For my waterline, I'll be using NYX Cosmetics Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Milk. For the transition around the eyes, I'll be taking the Lunatic Cosmetics Lab Contour Book. This is volume one, and I'll be taking the lightest gray shade to the left of the book. Then I'll be going into my trusty Creepy Cute palette by Strobe Cosmetics, and I'll be taking the shade Tombstone to further darken up that crease. Then back into the Lunatic Cosmetics Labs Contour Palette and taking the shade darker than the gray that I previously used. I'll be taking a small detail brush for this because I want to darken up around the eye. I want to create some dimension there. And then I want to darken it even more, so I'll be taking Void from the Creepy Cute Palette and then drawing another thin line around the eye. The darker the shades get, the less of the eye that I'll cover with the shadow, if that makes any sense. We don't want her to have raccoon eyes, we just want to give some dimension to the eye shape. I'll be taking that gray shadow from the Creepy Cute Palette and a thin liner brush to create her eye bags. For lashes, I'll be taking the La Petite from House of Lashes. These are the singles and they're in the medium size. And I'll just be placing them around the white of the eye on the upper and lower lash line that I created. I'll be taking this classic horror liquid lipstick from LA Splash Cosmetics. I don't remember the exact name. And I'll be creating faux freckles with this. If you look at the non-black and white photo, she has freckles. So I made sure to add them in there. And then I'll be adding the liquid lipstick to my lips as well. All right, so that is it for this tutorial. I know it was super quick. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you are enjoying this series so far. Stay tuned for more Spookifies.